All right, here we are for match three. Hopefully not up against a deck like that last deck. Uh, this is totally fine. It's mono three drops, but they're all very decent three drops. So I will keep, maybe draw into a one drop or a two drop. Seems fine. Drop a forest, and I will find out who you are and punch you in the face. What did I just say? <laughs> as long as they don't follow it up with a swamp, everything's fine. Everything's fine. Key to the city. That's a two drop. Don't you play a swamp. Don't do it. Don't do it. Play a plains. Or a mountain. Or an island. Nope. Went and got a swamp. Sweet. This is fun. Now I'm Renegade. Sure. Cool thing. Good times. Key to the city. Pass the turn. I mean, this is just a, a fantastic video series explaining why I hate Ether Revolt and why I hate Leagues. I will take two. And then what am I going to drop? Might just hold up the Hungry Flames. Maybe kill the Renegade here. Play your Pima. Implement of Malice. But I like my cards. Uh, a gear seeker serpent. Well, in that case, we might want to do trawler. Uh, so we drop trawler next turn. We have four, five, six. So we're still short, right? Blue, blue, one, two, three, four. Yeah, we're still short one artifact. Um, so we could hold up the hungry flames. Hmm. No, let's drop the trawler. Trades with the renegade. Daring demolition. Down you go. I will take two. And then drop a drake. Maybe Drake and a turtle. Well, that sounds like a plan. However, I am going to want to hold up cards to throw away to this implement because all of these cards are very important right now. I will take two. Prep on. Sweet. Spire of Industry. Ether Swoopers, a card that we're going to play, or is it a card that we're going to throw away? I think it's a card that we're going to save to throw away. So I will simply attack you for one. Gotcha! Then I'll Hungry Flames the Renegade. Uh, I will take two off of it just in case... The five drop is a much better hun Hungry Flames or Welding Sparks target. Gonna make me discard. Well, that's why I kept the super. Bye, super. Uh, yeah, see ya, Renegade. See ya. Theorist. Don't mind if I do. And I will attack my opponent with my 2-5 turtle. <clears throat> Dealing the real damages here. In for 2. Down to 15. Pass the turn. 3 cards in hand. 4 mana. Interesting. So we've got a Welding Sparks for 4 at the moment. Um. Okay. Scavenger with a uh, Renegade going back on top. I would assume. How do we deal with a 4-6? It's a very good question. Puts the implement on top. Interesting. 
Renegade map. Well, that makes Welding Sparks 5 damage. I'll pass the turn. We could block with the turtle and Welding Sparks to finish off the scavenger. Mm -hmm. Implement of Malice. I don't want to discard my serpent. Gonna have to, though. Gonna have to. Because I need the Welding Sparks to live. Bye, Serpent. Nice knowing you. Electrostatic what? Alright. I will say, at least this deck wasn't the deck I expected. It's not stupid, dumb, uh... Uh, Tusker deck. <clears throat> Land, I think we'll keep that because we no longer need to cast the Serpent. We can keep that for key. Um, yeah, I will pass the turn. Need to dig for Scrapper Champion now. <clears throat> Opponent has Narnum, Renegade, and something in hand. We're going to get to see the something here. This is just another Daring Demolition. The Wild Wanderer going and getting another land. You got it. I guess the downside here is if we want to draw, we need to pay two, don't we? Ugh. Well, let's scry. Hey, how's it going, Scrapper? How's it going, opponent with no real removal in hand? Scrapper down. Double strike going to get you. So that's what, a three turn clock? Unbridled growth. Sack it, draw a card, play your renegade. And or top deck your perfect answer. Uh, Gonti, eh? Alright. I wonder what you'll get. <laughs> Is there anything decent left in her deck? Thopterist. Um. Thopterist. My face down card. It's an Ether Chaser. Pretty decent. Pretty decent. All right, I think we're still fine. I think we're still fine. So we will throw away this mountain. And we'll bash in for six. Gotcha. And then we'll pass the turn holding up a Welding Sparks. Narnum Renegade and something in hand. Something was a land. Narnum Renegade in hand. Um, pardon me? Pardon me? Oh no, the Renegade's not in hand. He got the implement. We don't know what's in hand. What's in hand is a battle at the bridge for 10. Sweet. Um, I can't have him gain that much life. So we're going to kill our own Scrapper Champion. That felt bad. <laughs> um, I will pay the two here, but we're in all kinds of trouble. Metallic Rebuke. Play land, pass the turn. Yuck. Yuck. Fun match, though. This isn't the deck I expected, and I'm very happy about that. We got rid of that deck in match two. Three energy, three life. 12 all, significantly better cards on my opponent's side. Coming to get me. Uh, so you can do this twice. So it'll be a 4-4. Four, four. Um, yeah, sure, I'll block that. You can make it a 4-4. Four, four. I'll take 6. Oh, that hurts. Um, yeah. Take 6.
Oh, yes, three more energy. So this can actually be an 8-8. Eight, eight. Sure thing. You got my turtle. R.I.P. turtle. Uh, well, I guess we throw away a land. But I don't think I have an answer. Island Crusher. Doesn't do it. That was fun. That was interesting. That was a really interesting deck. I like that. All right. Um, don't know that we have anything to do about that. We could get rid of the Pummeler. I feel like a lot of stuff we have gets rid of the Pummeler, though. Um, he's got a lot of BS. I think the Negate comes in. And out goes... Maybe the Inventor's Apprentice? We're just not that aggro. Maybe the Dreadnought? Yeah, let's cut the Dreadnought. <clears throat> All right, I will play first. Give me a decent hand. That's a one-lander. That's the opposite of what I asked for. Mulligan! God, bloody freaking damn it. All right, um, sure, fine, whatever. Turtle, yay. Oh, Magic Online has it in for me. <laughs> Uh, uh, Baral. Oh, I just hate seeing that color combination. Just like to the depths of my bones. Highland, how's it going? Pass the turn. I will take one, and you can have a servo. Servo, no. We're in trouble. Just not land on top for the next four turns, please. Four real cards. Scrap trawler, but I have a scrap mm -hmm. trawler. We get a land. Pass the turn. This is how we die with a whimper. What you got? Pummeler, sure. Three of them, their energy thingies. In for four, eh? I will take four. And then I might have to come in with the turtle. Come on. Turtle, get in there. No, I can't get in with Turtle. Pummeler and a Servo would just kill it. Oh, Pummeler, Servo, Servo would kill it. And then I'm left with Brawl and nothing. Sure, team. Try me. Block. Block. Eat your Servos. Well, a Servo. Can I draw not a land, please? Not a land, please. Cavalry. This has been Spiky Saturday number 115. It's been super fun and a great example of my current luck when it comes to drawing lands on Magic Online. Perfect example of why I hate leagues. Perfect example of why I despise Aether Revolt. To the depths of my soul. Um, yeah, not a fun draft format. I will be super excited to be rid of it. Super excited. We're going to kill that. We're going to kill that. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. That's lethal, so we're not going to do it that way. We're going to log there. Take 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Go to 2. Kill off a Pummeler. And be left with a Baral and a top-decked land. Show me. Show me that land. There it is. There it is. What was on top? I don't even care. <laughs> that was a miserable experience, but that's kind of the overall experience of Ether Revolt. Not uh, one of my favorite formats. Not by far. I know some guys out there liked it, and that's great. Uh, totally enjoy it, uh, but I stand very firmly uh, with the label of Ether Revolt sucks. So, as I said, we're not going to do any more Ether Revolt. We are going to do Modern Masters next week. We're going to do Modern Masters the week after. The week after that, I'm not sure. I don't really know if I can justify doing three straight Ether or 
Modern Masters drafts with them being 25 tickets a piece. So we'll see about that. Uh, there will be some more Ether Revolt drafts because I will be doing those on stream because, again, I can't do a ton of Modern Masters drafts. Um, so hopefully those stream Ether Revolt drafts will go better. Uh, maybe having chat behind me will give me some luck on my lands and uh, my luck on my matchups, but we'll see about that. Anyways, let me know your final thoughts on Ether Revolt. Uh, as I said, I've seen a number of you say that it sucks. I've seen a number of you say that it's amazing. And uh, that's at least interesting for a format, for there to be such a broad uh, range of sucks to amazing kind of ratings. Anyways, if you have any questions, comments, or suggestions, you can find me on Twitter at the Manaleak. That's L E E K, like the vegetable, not the card. You can find me at facebook.com slash Manaleak, twitch.tv slash Manaleak, and patreon.com slash Manaleak. As always, click that thumbs up button if you like the content. Click the subscribe button if you want to see more. And if you do have any questions, comments, or suggestions, let me know. Otherwise, see you all next time for Modern Masters and not this stupid POS format.